Hello everyone, um, welcome back to Super Reality Tales. This is going to be a very different video from what I normally do. Uh, but about a week ago, as of this video being recorded and uploaded, I, uh, well, I dislocated my kneecap. Yeah, so let me explain the whole story. So what happened is uh, me and my brother, um, we were playing with Sonic the Hedgehog plushies. Um, just so you know, our bedroom, it's, it's very strange because it's like a small, it, compact room. And on one side, it has my brother's bed with a bunch of pictures and a, and a mountain of plushies on, on the side of it. And then on my side, it has a, like a, a wall of plushies on that side and some, a couple of pictures as well. So I think I fell, I, so I was like stuck down there it, I with the plushies and that. So what happens is that, all right, so uh, what happened is my brother was on my bed as well while we were playing plushies. And um, he uh, jumped, he thought, and then landed on my leg. And I was like, oof, that hurts. And then I realized it shifted. Like, here it is right now. It moved to the side, and then I was screaming in pain. So, and everyone heard. Every, yes, everyone. So I didn't know what to do. So I just positioned my leg up, uh, like, sturdy, like this in this kind of position and um i just laid in the bed and then my parents um called uh the the 911 and uh the, they came and they had to take me on a stretcher all the way to the ambulance downstairs so i had to take the elevator and again the ele the elevator is small so they have to compress everything in there and um uh, i also took a, a sonic plush sonic the hedgehog um so then they they just put me in uh me and my mom in the ambulance uh they took us there they were i was in um the ambulance and they I, they couldn't go real fast because of my leg moving because anytime it moved from this position it would hurt and anytime i would tense up it would hurt as well and i couldn't control really it, me having my leg tense up so it, it it really hurt it felt like um but for if people want to know how it felt it felt like the the bone was coming out of the skin and uh it, it, i know it, it's pretty it's pretty it, it, that sounds pretty gross so we made it there um the there were like three guys in there that so that when we were there and then there were three guys who took us um, out of the ambulance and into the hospital. Um, I don't. I do know their the names of them. I actually were friends with them because on the way there we talked about Sonic the Hedgehog and our fav and my favorite Sonic games. And just to let you know, it's it's SA two. I mean, it's it has to be Sonic Adventure two, one of the best Sonic games in the world. Um, but anyone can have their own opinion on Sonic. If anyone likes Sonic O six. Then they're probably kind of alone in that situation. But, um, so, back to the story. Um, the doctors came in. Uh, my dad also came. He drove in a separate car. Um, I was put on to the bed. Uh, and before they could try to fix my leg, um, the, one of the doctors came. And they had, like, uh, an IV. They put it in my arm. And they gave it me, like, this, um, sort of, like, druggy stuff that would um keep the pain painkiller thing if and i it was right here it, can you see that it was right there and uh so they gave me that i felt very dizzy and i didn't really feel any pain from the leg really anymore so then what happened is that my mom took some pictures of my leg and that and then what happened the doctor came on the bed grabbed my leg and then pushed it like this and then and then snapped it into place and uh it was fixed just like that so but i still couldn't move it in that because they just fixed it so i had to have it like this for a bit and um yeah i just waited a bit they gave me some crutches um so i could use them for like maybe a day or two and um yeah then my parents um the doctors they took me to the car and my parents um they they drove me home and then I just and I I just went back to s sleep and 
like the whole situation never happened. And uh, they had to put my leg in a cast, just so you know. But that's not the end of the story. Um, there's there's more to this a bit, and I'm gonna just catch you up from what's happened. And also, if people are wondering, yes, I have apologized my to my brother. It, it was an accident, but he knows now that um can't jump around near me anymore until maybe this is healed a bit more. But um, if anyone wants to know what it looked like, um, fair warning, um, I might get a, a, an age restriction for this if I show it. it there, there is no blood, but it's very gross. So if no one wants to see this, probably skip ahead like maybe 10, 10 or 5 seconds from this. All right, there you, you guys want to see it? All right, so three, two, one. Bam! And that that's what it looks like. I know, it's gross. You probably can't unsee that anymore. But, yeah. Um, so, the next day, um, they took me, my mom and dad took me to an upper hospital, uh, to a doctor who is actually one of their friends. Um, his name was Dr. Malcolm. And, um, they, I came to the, the hot, to the hot, <laughs> to the doctor's office, and, uh, they just wanted to see how my leg was doing, and they took me out of the cast and then gave me this new cast where it, like, kept the kneecap in place, but I could have mobility on the leg, so I could move it, but I couldn't move it like this a lot, because that would, uh, probably do damage to it. So then they talked about, um, a way to make this not happen anymore, and this is for everyone else. If you do not want this to happen, I suggest you exercise, because... I don't do that a lot, but so, but I'm gonna start doing that right now once this is a bit more healed up. And you wanna know, um, this is actually a different cast. This is not either of those casts. It's not really a cast. Um, it's like a leg um thing. It's like supposed to cushion, like hug the leg, and it actually feels kind of good. But I take it off most of the time to itch, and it itches because the tissue on this is healing, like, you know, the stuff in your legs and limbs. Yeah. All right. So, uh, yeah, I've just been wearing this for a bit, and yeah, that's the whole story. Um, that's everything that's happened about it, and I just, I just wanted you guys to... What is that? Brother, stop. Brother, please stop. Alright, so, um, this is actually what it looks like now. Oh, uh, hold on. Uh, it kind of has some... I when I took that cast off, um, the one that keeps this secure and in like that, um, there was kind of a few marks on here. But it's nothing too graphic. Uh, it's a bit swollen compared to my other kneecap, but it, it's gonna get better soon. Then I could take this off, but maybe not because it's so comfy. But yeah, that's the whole story, guys. Um, and how long has this? It's this isn't really affected any, you know, YouTube videos. Um, currently, if you go, I I don't think it's out now. It might be soon, but um. On uh, my plush channel, Super Sonic. Okay, before I say something, I think it's time. Guys, it's time to reveal my name. I've been keeping this a secret for so long, and I've kind of hinted it in past videos, but do you guys want to know my real name is? And I have got permission because it's on my plush channel, so you might all not already know this. But my name is. Drum roll, please, brother. Bam! It's Ronan. Yep, my name is Ronan. It's spelled R O H N A N. So yeah. We have Aussie names. Good eye, Mike. <sighs> Even though we're not from Australia. Anyways, um, yeah, that's my name. So people who call me Reality or Super Reality Tales, just call me Ronan now, or or Ro, or 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 just any, or you can go back to calling me Reality. That if that it's that if you like that, but. Yeah, th that's this whole story, uh, plus a name reveal. But yeah, if you check out Supersonic with Ronan, I have a new plush video. I think that's going to come out soon, like later today. Um, and just a quick thing I want to say, it's going to star Eggman. Yep, Eggman's going to be in it. It won't be on this channel. Remember, it's on the Supersonic Ronan channel, so you can just go check that out by searching it up on YouTube or um, just looking for it on my channel's tab. So yeah, that's the video guys, um, it hasn't affected any, the leg issue hasn't affected any video making, still making videos, um, but yeah, if you want to show me your support, um, you can go in the comments and say something nice, if you want to, just don't say anything mean, okay, you have only two options, don't say anything, or, uh, comment, but, 
but saying something nice is is is, is good. But yeah, um, thank you for watching this, guys. Um, I hope your day's gonna be good. Hope this leg's gonna be good. And yeah, thanks to my brother for helping me record. And I'll see you all, ladies and gentlemen, in the next super video, Super Reality Tales. Goodbye. Also, um, the two guys in the ambulance were called Chris and Kevin, and the doctor was called Dr. Simi.